नमस्ते वेलकम टू द नेक्स्ट वीडियो ऑफ मशीन लर्निंग टेक्निक्स कोर्स इन दिस वीडियो विल डिराइव लॉस फंक्शन फॉर लॉजिस्टिक रिप्रेशन एज वी न्यू फ्रॉम द प्रीवियस वीडियो दैट देर आर टू टाइप्स ऑफ लॉजिस्टिक रिप्रेशन सेटअप्स दैट वी स्टडीड वन वॉज विद द फीचर वैक्टर्स एंड सेकेंड इज विद ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन अप्लाइड टू द फीचर वैक्टर बिफोर डूइंग लिनियर कॉम्बिनेशन एंड अप्लाइंग सिग्मॉइड ऑन इट so here the learning problem is to estimate the weight vector w based on the training data by minimizing the loss function through appropriate optimization procedure now we'll focus on deriving the loss function for logistic regression in this case we'll consider a binary classification setup let us assume that probability of y equal to 1 given the feature vector parameterized by w is hw of x and probability that y is equal to 0 given feature vector x parameterized by w is 1 minus hw x there are only two classes 1 and 0 so obviously the probability that the sample belongs to y equal to 0 given x is 1 minus probability of uh, sample belonging to class 1 given the feature vector so that's how we we represent these two probabilities now we can rewrite both these equations compactly as follows so probability of y given the feature vector parameterized by w is hw of x raised to y into 1 minus hw of x raised to 1 minus y so let us see that this equation is indeed equivalent to what we have written here so for y is equal to 0 you know we substitute y as 0 in these equations and what we get is hw of x raised to 0 into 1 minus hw of x raised to 1 minus 0 so this is this quantity becomes 1 and what we are left with is 1 minus hw x for y is equal to 1 we substitute 1 in place of y and we get hw of x so now you can see that for y is equal to 1 probability of y is equal to 1 given x is hw of x as you can see over here and probability of y equal to 0 given x is 1 minus hw of x for n independently generated training examples we can write the likelihood of parameter vector as l of w which is likelihood is equal to probability of the entire label vector given the feature matrix parameterized by w now this probability can be write as product of n independent probabilities for each example so yi is the label for ith example given the feature vector for the ith example and we calculate that probability and we multiply n such probabilities to get this joint probability now we can write we know that this quantity can be written as h of h of x of uh, xi raised to yi into 1 minus h of xi raised to 1 minus yi so the likelihood can be expressed in this particular form we'll take log on both sides and why do we take logs because maximizing the log likelihood is easier so we take log of log log of likelihood is equal to log of the right hand side so log of likelihood is written as lw and once we take this log inside this uh, inside the bracket and we can you know apply simple algebraic rule we get the log likelihood as summation over all n examples yi log of h of xi plus 1 minus yi log of 1 minus h of xi so our job is to find out parameter vector w such that log of likelihood or lw is maximized so equivalently we can minimize the negative log likelihood to maintain the uniformity with other algorithms so we we write the similar or we write the 
we write the familiar term of JW and JW is equal to negative of the likelihood. So when we take the negative of the log, negative of the log likelihood, we get minus of summation over 1 to n yi log of hxi plus 1 minus yi into log of 1 minus h of xi. And this particular loss is called as a binary cross entropy loss. So this is how the binary cross entropy loss looks like. The, the binary cross entropy loss is, is a convex loss function. And you can, I, we have seen, we have shown this particular loss with with two uh, with with two features and there are weights corresponding to those two features which is w1 and w2 and what you see is the contour of the loss surface and you can see that this is the region where uh, and this is the this is the color coding of the loss values so the darker color represents lower loss and as the colors become fainter the loss increases so for example on the edge we have we have higher loss and as we move towards this particular region, we have lower, lower loss. So the, so the binary cross entropy loss function is a convex loss function and since it's a convex loss function, it will have exactly a single global minima and it will be easier for us to optimize that loss function with, you know, something like gradient descent procedure. That will be the topic of our next video where we will study how to, how to obtain the weight vector w by minimizing the negative log likelihood uh, loss function.